When you're learning to code, it's really important that you practice coding. And by that, I mean, you know, not just reading books and not just following tutorials, but ac actually taking the code that you've learned, the, the skills that you've learned and applying them to problem solving or applying them to projects. One of the real challenges, I think, for a beginner is knowing what sort of problems and what sort of projects to work on. It can be a little bit bewildering. And what I want to share with you today, and I think it's going to be really helpful, it certainly was helpful for me, are some websites that provide you with the sort of problems and challenges that you need in order to become proficient at coding. I've linked to them all in the description and I'm going to go through them very quickly now. The first one is called Project Euler. Project Euler is quite a mathematical site in that the challenges are, are usually quite mathematical. But what I like about it is that it has a very large community. And once you've solved a problem, you can see solutions from other people as well. Uh, and you can compare how you've done it with how other people have done it. Um, and, you know, and that's a quite a strong and helpful community that will really uh, help you to learn, I think. So I would definitely recommend Project Euler. Uh, the next one that I would recommend is Code Wars. And incidentally, a lot of these uh, sites are also uh, geared towards sort of interview prep as well. So if you are applying for jobs, you know, it'll help you with the sort of uh, questions that you might get during an interview. Another good site is the um, daily programmer page on Reddit. Um, there are lots of co coding challenges on there and there's also a very helpful community as well. So uh, check that one out. And what else is there? Code Signal. This is another one of those sites that is geared um, to interview prep as well as coding challenges um, and definitely worth a look. The next one is Coding Game. Uh, uh, take a look at that and then you know some of these have various different levels some of them are aimed at beginners to intermediate coders um, whereas others are definitely more advanced one of the good sites for beginners is codabyte um, which you can see here hacker rank is another very well known code challenge and uh, interview prep site uh, take a look at that as is sphere online judge or um, spoj also take a look at top coder now this may be a little bit um, weighted towards sort of intermediate to advanced programmers, but it's definitely worth uh, a look and it's a very popular site of this type. Code Chef is another one. More of an intermediate one is Geeks for Geeks. There's Code Forces, which is um, really quite advanced. Uh, so if you're feeling very confident, take a look at that one. But perhaps for beginners, it might not be the best one to start with. Um, there's Hacker Earth. And finally, one that I really like, but it's particularly aimed at Python, um, is the Python Challenge. That's pythonchallenge.com. So take a look at that. I really hope those resources will help you to improve your coding skills. I think they will. It's really important that you work on problems. So do try to find one of those uh, sites that you like and stick with it and try to do you know, a problem every day or certainly a couple of problems a week if you can. There are more Python learning resources listed in the description to this video too. If you like this video, please hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.